students in this video we are going to learn about spreadsheet in this chapter we will learn about introduction to spreadsheet open save and close spreadsheet enter data in spreadsheet basic calculations addition basic calculation subtraction basic calculation multiplication basic calculation division insert column and row format cell and its contents stock register register customizing the interface use currency symbol format cell content font style and size delete column and row spell check means spelling check border the cells color the cells managing worksheet in a workbook print a worksheet these all topics we will learn in this spreadsheet chapter first topic is introduction to spreadsheet first what is the spreadsheet here is the definition of spreadsheet an electronic document in which data is arranged in and columns of a grid and can be manipulated and used in as calculation is known as spreadsheet means when data is arranged in row and columns used as calculation then it is known as spreadsheet the term spreadsheet means a large piece of paper that accountants used for business finances the advantages of spreadsheets are record management analyzing data creating mis what is the meaning of mis management information system report generating graphs for pictorial representation of data making financial calculating easy managing inventory and budgeting these are the advantages of spreadsheet then names of some spreadsheet software first is ms excel microsoft excel second is open office calc third is google document next topic is getting started with spreadsheet means how to start a spreadsheet double click on a shortcut key of ms excel icon if available on the desktop means if that in the desktop there is a shortcut key of ms excel then we will click on that icon or else we will click on the start menu then all programs then we will click on microsoft office then finally microsoft office excel then microsoft excel will be opened on our screen now we will read some of the key components of the spreadsheet first is worksheet a grid of horizontal row and vertical column is called worksheet means one complete page means this is this whole page is called one worksheet workbook a workbook contains one or more worksheet just like example this one page is called worksheet and workbook means number of pages when attached together then it creates a book like that number of worksheets creates workbook in the figure 1 here is the figure 1 the figure 1 has three worksheet named sheet 1 sheet 2 and sheet 3 means when we will open the ms excel there will be three default worksheet named as sheet 1 sheet 2 and sheet 3 a row is a horizontal arrangement of cell row is named with numbers like 1 2 3 4 and further are given to the row column column is the vertical arrangement of cell it is named with alphabets a b c d likewise up to z after z it is a a a b a c are named as column next is cell what is the meaning of cell the place where the row and column intersect is called a cell when row and column are intersected then that 
box is called a cell each cell has some name and that name is called cell address and it is formed with the combination of column name and row number like a2 or b16 this is the cell name next is active cell the cell on which the cursor is currently placed is known as active cell in this figure this a1 cell is the active cell means that cell which is bordered with one black box dark black box that is the active cell next is formula bar the formula bar is below the ribbon this is the formula bar it displays the content of the active cell whatever content is written in this cell will be displayed in this formula bar scroll bar this help to scroll through the content and body of the spreadsheet this is known as scroll bar there are two scroll bar horizontal and vertical